in the left shift operator we have seen that it is multiplying the actual value by 2 and here in the right shift what happens is we are going to divide the actual value by 2 so let's see that so what happens right shift but how the operation is done the operation done by the right shift so the method the methodology used for the right shift operation is bit different from the left shift that is why it is called as arithmetic shift and the operations that were the, the mechanisms that we are going to understand are common in every programming language so what is this arithmetic shift right shift arithmetic right shift so what does that mean is we are going to use the same bit the right mode right rightmost bit is used as it is so in this case we have taken it as zero now the right shift is done towards right previously it is left right so now starting from this right uh, rightmost bit the shift happens so this one will come here so this one will be zero this one will come here this one will come here and this but this bit will come here and this bit will come here and this one here and this one here now what is happening so what is what is the outcome that we are going to get and the decimal equivalent of this is 12 uh, and the decimal equivalent of this of this binary value is 6 so try to understand this and the operation is different whatever the value that we have that we have in the rightmost part that has to be used as it is why that we will try to understand in our later coming videos but in this video you just try to remember this one single point what does in the right shift operation what we have to do is the rightmost bit if there is a one that one has to be used as it is but in our case we are having a zero so we are going to use that bit as it is and now the shift happens try to understand this that is the reason why so this is what this kind of operation is what we call it as arithmetic shift